Ciao, fellow Vita comrades, and welcome. Today we have this PS Vita 1000 without the memory card on the 3.74 firmware, and we will be hacking it and creating internal partition like internal memory card, same like PS Vita 2000 has, all without using the PC. So let's get cracking. First, let's hack the Vita using the latest web browser handle exploit. Connect to the internet, open web browser and type in jailbreak.psp2.dev. They have changed it from deploy.psp2.dev, so now it's jailbreak.psp2.dev. We are greeted with new interface, thanks to Freakler. We can either check the change lock, readme, or we can unlock our PS Vita. So we press unlock my Vita, and then unlock again, which will launch the exploit chain, and we will land at Henlo bootstrap menu. Then we want to install Henkaku, press X on this option. When it is installed, we also want to replace near bubble with Vita Deploy app, press X to confirm and then square as prompted to proceed. Let it do its thing, the Vita will reboot. If we will launch Vita Deploy app straight after reboot, it will just crash, cause we didn't run the exploit, cause we rebooted and exploit isn't permanent yet. So, run the exploit again, if there is an error, like I had, just reboot your Vita or delete cookies, but reboot can usually sort out majority of errors. So reboot, run the exploit, if we launch Vita Deploy now, it just goes into this kinda Vita shell menu, and that means we have to go to settings, then Henkaku settings, and then check enable unsafe homebrew. Now we can launch Vita Deploy fine. We go into miscellaneous, then create internal memory card. Then confirm that if anything goes wrong, there is no recovery. Well, we are doing not so official stuff, so that's understandable. Press X, then press X on the default 2000 storage configuration option, which will create 1GB partition on your internal storage. Then press any key to reboot. After the reboot, go to settings. Format, Format Memory Card, there is the checked option for internal 1GB memory card, press Next, then Format, then confirm the pop-ups, 2 times yes, formatting will be completed and Vita will restart yet again, quite a lot of reboots I know. Now after the reboot, to check we have been successful, we go into Settings, System, then System Information and as we can see, it is here, 1GB of internal storage, mission uh -huh. has been accomplished. Go. Now you can carry on with downgrading to 3.65, installing Enzo, installing SD2 Vita and all the good stuff. There are plenty of guides for that, but I haven't seen video for creating internal memory card, so I thought I'd make one. I hope you like it, if so give it a thumbs up and subscribe cause there is more quality content to come. Thanks to developers for hard work, thanks to you for watching and I'll see you in the upcoming one. Peace out. Mission accomplished.